seem like a small thing, a swing stolen off the front porch of a Sycamore Township home. But as Tessa Dottero reports, that swing took the family's disabled son out of his shell. It's a story you'll see only here on Local 12. Every day, Zachary Hempel sits in this red swing on his front porch. Yeah, and all the neighbors that go for walks yell, yell to him <laughs> when they go by. So, I mean, it, it, meant, it meant a lot to him, you know? I mean, there's only so much my poor little guy can do. During the pandemic, porch time in the swing connects him to the world. When he's inside, he'll always crawl to the door and he'll ask to come outside every time. He's not able to do much. Um, so to be able to sit out, he loves watching cars. He loves watching people. Today, he has nowhere to sit. It's just kind of messed up because it's just something he really loves. The swing is gone. At about 4 a.m., um, I heard uh, rustling around out here. The sheriff's got here pretty quickly, and they said they didn't see anything on their way in. Zachary has trouble walking and getting around. The large swing kept him comfortable. How hollow or desperate do you have to be to steal something like that from, you know, obviously a special needs household? The family is looking for a replacement, but in the meantime, they hope whoever took it has a change of heart. We have so many friends and family that are like wanting to help and get him a new one. And like, it's been so touching to me how much everybody loves Zach. In Sycamore Township, Tessa Tiro, Local 12 News. If you know anything about where that stolen swing might be, you're asked to contact the Hamilton County Sheriff's Office.